What if the future of farming wasn't about seeds, soil or sunlight, but about software, servers and artificial intelligence? Welcome to Cy the Cyborg Farmer's World, where the farmland is a digital landscape and the crops are AI agents. In the heart of this digital farmland lies Cy's Farm, a vast network of servers, data centers and software platforms. Here, AI agents grow, learn, evolve and work creating a bustling ecosystem of digital labor. Each AI agent, like a digital seed, sprouts into a unique entity with the potential to perform tasks ranging from data analysis to creative problem solving. This isn't a science fiction tale. This is the reality of farming in the year 2024. Just as cattle once powered the plow and the steam engine revolutionized labor, AI agents are now the new muscle powering a wide array of services and industries. But unlike physical labor, AI doesn't tire. It doesn't need food or rest. It simply works tirelessly and efficiently without ever taking a break. This new form of labor has the potential to liberate humans from mundane, repetitive tasks. It promises to open up new realms of creativity and innovation. Imagine a world where humans are free to pursue their passions to explore new ideas, to innovate and create without the constraints of manual labor. That's the dream that Cy the Cyborg Farmer is working towards. But what are the implications of this new form of labor? What happens to the jobs displaced by AI? And what about privacy concerns? As we increasingly rely on AI for labor, we must also confront these ethical and societal questions. Job displacement is a real concern. As AI becomes more capable, it's inevitable that some jobs will be automated. But just as the steam engine created new jobs, even as it displaced old ones, AI has the potential to create new industries and opportunities. The challenge is to ensure that these opportunities are accessible to everyone, not just the privileged few. Privacy too is a critical issue. As AI agents become more intelligent, they also become more capable of collecting and analyzing data. We must establish guidelines to ensure that this data is used responsibly and that privacy is respected. Finally, we must consider the broader impact of AI on global economies and social structures. If AI becomes the dominant form of labor, how will wealth be distributed? How will societies adapt to this new reality? In the end, AI is a tool, not a solution. It's up to us to determine how we use this tool. Will we use it to exploit or to enhance, to create a dystopian future of inequality and surveillance, or a future where AI liberates us from mundane tasks, allowing us to explore new realms of creativity and innovation? In the story of Cy the Cyborg Farmer, we see a glimpse of this future. We see the potential of AI, the challenges it presents, and the choices we must make. It's a story that asks us to consider not just the future of farming, but the future of work, society and humanity itself. So as we stand on the precipice of this new era, we must ask ourselves, how will we farm the future?